Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create intro with text in CopCut PC. So what we have to do right now is just to import our video. There's two ways. You just can you can simply open your file, and then you can just go drag and drag and drop your file right in the timeline here, or you can also click on import right over here. All right, I just added the video. Now I'll just write. Uh, click separate the video, separate the audio from the video because I just don't need this audio from in this tutorial. So now, the next uh, step to create a tutorial or intro is we have to grab a transition. So from here, we can uh, just move this cursor and control B can add a transition right over here when this intro will end. And I like to grab uh, this, this transition here, rotate, and then here we'll add some text. So after, I'll actually zoom in as well. So after the transition, this text will appear with our channel name or whatever you want here. Hello. Hello, something like this, maybe. Hello, or um, I'll write the name of the tutorial how to create something, anyways. But this is the title of the video, and then you can hear uh, it looks good if you add this, um, this background like this, and now you can add to this text transition as well or animation first of all this animation what will look good is some type animation but what doesn't look good is this opacity is too bright and now you can change other things as well you can maybe add change this text so it looks better and uh, or you can remove the background depends now on uh, scenario depends on uh, what you're trying to create or what effects you're using but in this case it will look good if you but also make sure here in animation you increase the duration of the typing effect and now so it starts like this and also what i like to do is just to decrease the scale so here we have this color white and then uh, after this it starts, after this tutorial, this intro starts, which in this scenario, because we played, it looks like it's too slow. So also click on the transition and make sure it's at the maximum. And now we have the transition. Now you can also add your logo. You can click on import and add your own logo. Let's say this is my logo, I'll just grab this logo and put it right over here when this text will start. Okay, I'll just need to select this. Let's say this is my logo. So we have this logo and uh, text, logo and text. Perfect. So now that's how you create a very simple logo. You don't have to complicate if it's something simple. Also, just so you know, you also have here some uh, templates that look pretty good. And there's already animation, already have animation added to that text. So it's pretty good to try all these templates. CopCard has really good, nice templates. So it's really good when you start your tutorial your video, your editing, when you start working on your project, you should, you should really uh, test this um, templates here. And um, just so you know, you can also, let's say you want some uh, back uh, background, you can um, just remove this portion. can add this here and then here this text now it's uh, it's black or you can also change this if you have video here or animation anything you can go to color and you can just simply change the color that you want 
um, color and here let's add oh this color looks good and we can remove this if you don't want that's the cool part and now here we have our text and it's also really cool this one as well then this um, our, our video will start here and um, the end of this you can also add another transition which is uh, not a shake or a tate on the other side but you can increase this a little bit more which I still don't like it's too fast but make sure it's more slow so it's not too fast I don't like here in this case. So as the I, you know, experience I've tried multiple ex experience multiple effects. It's it's better when you transition. You can see the transition more. Like the transition will last for more seconds. Um, that's where that's what you should try to aim for. Yeah. Uh, let me remove this. yeah now that's better so i really hope guys you found this tutorial helpful make sure you subscribe and i'll see you now in the next tutorial take care